And welcome back guys, we're going to be playing some more Days Gone, make sure it's the like button, make sure it's the grab button, let's get back into it. Hmph! <laughs> Got it. Yeast, yeast. Yes. Yes. I hope this is enough. If you can. Needed this. That should be it. St. John to uh, Lieutenant Whitaker, reporting in. Uh, Deacon, uh, <coughs> Corporal St. John, yes. I, uh, got the item on your requisition form. The yeast, there wasn't much. Uh, I'm sure that whatever you have is going to be So, uh, just curious, uh, why do you need... Sorry, I'm right in the middle of something. I gotta go. I'll talk to you when you bring it in. Whitaker, out. Okay.
all this crap. <clears throat> Isn't the world screwed up enough as it is? Oh, God damn it. Ma'am? Would you stop doing that, please? I'm sorry? I know that things are strange, but I can't help that right now. Well, I live in a barracks with a dozen militia assholes when my wife lives in a private tent up on an officer's ridge. Nothing strange about that. Deacon. And the only time that I see her is when I'm done running one of her errands. Nothing strange about that either, ma'am. My yeast, thank you. Uh, are, are you baking something? I mean, if you need an oven, I know no, where to find no, one. No, no, I'm using it to create <clears throat> viral proteins that they, they trigger these antibodies. <laughs> but of course, you are being sarcastic. Bread, viral proteins, it's all the same to me. Hey, wait a second. Here. Thank you. You already said that. And then for staying. Yes, ma'am. St. John, this is Dr. Jimenez. St. John? Hey, Doc, this is Deacon. What can I do for you? Oh, St. John, mm. you're good. Nice hole. I need you to stop by the infirmary. Uh, is something wrong? You need something? No, no, nothing like that. I want to check on that arm. Oh, my arm, my, hey, my arm's fine, Doc. Move along, buddy, move along. A like that, from a wood stove, is nothing to play around with. You want la infección? You come see me. That's an order. All right, Doc. All right, fine. Whatever you say. St. John out. Huh? Ah, okay. I see you, Corporal. Hey, you sleep with that gun, am I right? Uh, Corporal St. John. So, man, I gotta tell you something. Okay. I knew you from before. Well, not personally, you know, but I'm from Farewell. Same as you. And me and my friends, we used to watch you guys around town. The, the mongrels, I mean. Riding those hogs, wearing your leathers. Man, we thought you guys were so badass. Right. Is that right? Yeah, yeah, man. Uh, Corporal, see ya. St. John, this is Captain Curry. Come in. Yeah, Captain. I'm here. Well, I just wanted to let you know that the Colonel gives an informal talk every day at dusk at the staging area where you were sworn in. Uh, yes, sir. Now, all these talks are... are ...informal. Enlisted men and women are expected to attend. <clears throat> uh, copy that, sir. Curry out. Great. To give fireside chats. Can't wait. In a few days, dozens of new recruits have joined our ranks. We welcome you. We do not care about the color of your skin. We do not care what country you were born in. We do not care if you are a man or a woman. We do not care if you are gay or lesbian or bisexual or transgender. 
These are things beyond your control. These are things that God has ordained, and we accept them. What we do not accept are liars, thieves, rapists, murderers, fornicators, adulterers, oath breakers, drug addicts, or criminals of any kind from this life or the one before. How you conduct yourself, how you act in the eyes of God, these are things that you do control. Any soldier or officer found guilty of any transgression, no matter how small, will be brought here to this very scaffold and will be hanged by the neck until they are dead. This punishment may seem cruel to some of you, but you have my promise. Any punishment of ours is a great mercy compared to the punishment of God that is being unleashed on the world outside these walls. None of us is perfect. We do not expect perfection. What we do expect is obedience, order, and discipline. Give us these things, and we will win this war. Company dismissed. Hey, Doc. Uh, Come in. Siéntese. Have a seat. Have a seat. Mm -hmm. oh. Let's look here. So, who did you ride with back in the day? Uh, <laughs> I don't know what you're uh, getting at. No me mientas. Look, Corporal. I spent 20 years in East L.A. patching up bandas de motoristas and every other kind of pandillero. I know the look. And this? No kind of wood stove did this. All right. Keep it clean. It'll heal on its own. Leave a nasty scar. But I want you to come back and see me in a couple of days. You got it. Funny thing. When the city burned and the hordes came in, neighborhoods at war for decades all came together. Fought together. Latinos, Gueros, Chinos, Bloods, Crips. Didn't matter. Crazy what it takes to bring people together sometimes, no? Thanks, Doc. St. John, come in. Taylor, Deacon St. John. Taylor, haven't heard from you in a while. I was afraid that maybe you'd gotten too close to that man you were tracking. Oh, I'm close, all right. I'm right in the friggin' backyard. Hey, I need your help, man. I'm, I'm at, the, at a small camp south of Crater Lake, just off the South Rim Drive. Taylor, listen to me. I have no idea what you're doing, but you got... Come on, oh, shit! No, no, no! Let me go! Hey! No. Taylor? Taylor! Oh, damn it!
St. John to Lieutenant Whitaker. Come back. Switching to a private channel. Hold on. Deacon, are you there? Yeah. Uh, hey, so I, I looked at that requisition form. It says that you want silicate? Yeah, silicate. I use it as a distilling medium in the column chromatographer. Oh, column chrom... what? <sighs> Sorry, it's just it's the one part of my research that's actually going well. So, silicate, where do I get it? Oh, shit, I thought I marked it on the rack. Hold on. Okay, there's this little general store southwest of us near Mazama Village. You should be able to find it there. Okay, got it. Thank you. Sorry, never mind. <clears throat> Carry on, Corporal. Yes, ma'am. Uh, Lieutenant. Sarah, out. Silicate. What the fuck is silicate, anyway? Get back this really cool hat, so I'm starting to like this hat. I mean, really. <laughs> I bet. Okay. All right. <clears throat> I gotta get back to work. This yeast has already filled up like half a dozen petri dishes. Okay. Save me some of the viral proteins. I got an appetite out here. I'll do that. Lieutenant Whitaker out. Sir, I'll be right there. Corporal St. John out. where your camp is. Maybe we'll let you live. Fuck you. <laughs> Bring him down. I don't think he can hear us. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see if we can do something about that. I'm not telling you shit. Come on. Shut up. Can you hear him? Oh. 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 Get him the fuck out of here. Come on. What do you think? Maybe we could turn this in at that army camp. Get some credits. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm coming, Taylor. Hang in there.
torture, do you? But this. Why do you like this, you son of a bitch? Who was that? Friend. Hey, Drifter. It's like torture, do ya? But this. That did it. Better days, I'll be honest with you. Okay. Uh, Jesus. Okay, listen to me, pal. Take this, hold it against your head like that. Good. Now, I want you to wait here. I'm gonna go radio Captain Curry. He's gonna send someone to pick you up, all right? All right, man. Uh, yeah, hell yeah. Captain Corey, this is Corporal St. John. Come back. This is Corey. I'm here with Lieutenant Whitaker, checking on your progress. Corporal, I've told Captain Curry that you're an immense help. I don't know what I would do without you. Well, that's great. I, that's not why I'm checking in. Captain, uh, there's a marauder camp just off of South Rim Drive. Marauders? This close to the island? Uh, no, listen, no, 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 no. Um, Dealt with these bastards, but we have an injured man, Private Taylor. They fucking slice his ear off. Jesus, is he all right? Private Taylor? What was he doing out there? He's... Yeah, he's gonna live. No, no idea what he was doing out here. I need you to send docu uh, Captain Jimenez and some men to come out and get him. I'll send you the coordinate. <laughs> he's... Yeah, he's gonna live. No, no idea what he was doing out here. I need you to send docu uh, Captain Jimenez and some men to come out and get him. I'll send you the coordinates. I'll head up there now and let him know. Hurry out.
Taylor, how you doing, buddy? Like I said, man, I've, I've had better days. Uh, <laughs> hey, I think the bleeding stopped. Oh, well, no, no, it hasn't. Uh, help is on the way. You hang tight. Uh, you want me to come back? Wait with you? No, oh, oh, hell no, no, no. I mean, I, I already feel like a little bitch, you know. I'm, I'm fine, I'm fine, really. I'll stop by the infirmary later. See how you're doing. Hey, I've Hey, you. I haven't seen you around here before. Name's Jacob D'Angelo. Everybody calls me D. St. John, Deacon. So, uh, you're the guy to come to for hardware? You got it, pal. You need guns, I got guns. If I don't have it, it was never made, you know what I mean? Uh, great. I'll keep that in mind. Corporal St. John, you stay safe, yeah? Hey, Corporal. How's life? Sarge. Later, Sarge. A corporal. Hey, Sarge. Yeah, I can fix that. Okay. Corporal, see you, man.
Yes. Ooh. Be right around. This looks like the spot. Let's go find some silicate. All right, fellas, how you getting inside? Should be able to climb up here. Delicate. This will work. Okay, now I just gotta find a way out of here. Oh, somebody didn't know what a Yes. Yes. Okay. I'll just park this anywhere. Sarah, are you there? I've, um, got the silicate you requested. Corporal St. John, yes, I'm here. I'm in a meeting with Lieutenant Weaver. Corporal St. John? What are you doing another run for me? Oh, uh, I don't know. Uh... Weaver! Corporal, report in to me when you get back to the island. Lieutenant Whitaker out. Fucking Weaver now. What the fuck is he doing? Hey, Doc. You there? This is Corporal St. John, the Doc Jimenez. Come back. Uh, St. John, how's the arm? Good. Good. Uh, that ointment, or whatever it is that you gave me, it's, um, yeah, it's working great. I'll be the judge of that. Hey, so I'm actually just checking in to see, uh, well, to see how well you know Lieutenant Weaver. Lieutenant Weaver? I know him as well as I know any of the officers. Why? I don't know. I'm just, uh, I'm, I'm doing some runs for them, for him and Lieutenant Whitaker, and it just, it seems like he's, um, I don't know, he's, he's in her face all the time, and, uh, I don't fucking like it. <laughs> Lieutenant Whitaker can take care of herself. Listen to me, St. John. 
The colonel tolerates a certain amount of razzing amongst the officers. If I were you, I'd stay out of it. All right, Doc. And don't worry about Lieutenant Weaver. He's no saint, but I've met worse. Him and his help. I bet you all thought I'd forgotten about you, huh? Yeah? Another MMU. Wonder what Nero left behind this time. What's going on? See if they got an underground bunker around here. Well, that looks like a good place to stop. Make sure to the like button, make sure to subscribe button. That horde coming out of nowhere, I'm like, oh, shit. Let me go hide in the bush and wait for that to pass. Anyways, when we come back, you'll see me try to get this Nero facility up and running. I don't know, there's a horde sitting right there. Anyways, make sure to the like button, make sure to subscribe button. I'll see you guys in the next video.